everyone and welcome back to another episode of Dryland Dimensions with me Ati Jo and today we're going to be discussing how to perform and measure field assessment for swimmers. So we're going to be using a vertical jump and a horizontal jump to measure lower body power. We're going to be using a backward med ball toss to measure upper body power and we're going to be doing planks to measure core stability. A very inexpensive way to test your vertical jump is by using a piece of chalk. So you're gonna place a mark on your middle finger which is supposed to be your longest finger and without overextending you're gonna stand and place your hand against the wall. So that's your first marker. So on your command or on your coach's command, however you all decide to do the test, you are gonna jump as high as possible and you're gonna make another mark with the same finger. So you're gonna measure the distance between the first mark and the second mark and that is your vertical jump height. measuring your broad jump or your horizontal jump you want to place a marker on the floor and have the athlete stand directly behind them on your command or whenever they are ready to go they jump as far forward as possible landing on both feet and you measure from behind directly behind the heel to behind the line where they started <laughs> Similar to the broad jump or the horizontal jump, when setting up for the backward med ball toss, you want to have the athlete stand behind the line. This time you want to have them facing the opposite direction so that their heels are facing the line. Alright, and on your command or whenever they're ready to go, they throw the medicine ball, no more than 10 pounds, as far as possible over their head. have a huge part to play in swimming so today we're going to be using a plank since it can be measured using a stopwatch So now you have collected all the data and you're probably wondering, what do I do with this? Stay tuned for next week where we discuss how to evaluate results. Oh yeah, and be sure to follow me on Instagram at adijo7. <laughs>